What's going on, you guys? I'd like to welcome you guys to another DC TV talk. It's your boy Big Dog here with a review for Doom Patrol episode 14, Penultimate Patrol. Dog, this show is mind blowing. It is insanely good. This was a phenomenal, one of the best episodes. And when I say one of the best episodes, that's saying a lot because I liked literally every single episode. There was one episode that wasn't as great as the other ones, but every other episode has been great. This one was at the top of the list. Not the, like it, like the show keeps everything in order in a way that you just kind of like, how do you mix so many different things and still have it come off that it, it works? To me, the the show goes like beyond Deadpool when it's with his with his R rating and, and, and comes down to like a Avengers level uh, a show of emotions. Like it is insane how they mix it and then the comment did it. You know, like it's definitely going full R, but like for the people who watch this, I think everybody has to appreciate this show. This is probably one of the best superhero shows I've ever seen in my life. It's definitely in my top five now. And the show, unless they just completely bomb episode 15, the, the season finale, this show is like damn near perfect and i have no connection to these characters i never read the comments or anything but on to the episode they go they're looking for uh <laughs> they're looking for the chief and they go back to Danny, the, the danny street and you know they flex is there uh and danny asks like hey how's the lords he basically breaks down like hey she's gone and then we see the place that mr nobody has the chief at is in the white it's the white stuff in between panels of a comic book. Who thinks of, nobody thinks of that. I'm just thinking it's just a, the white space. I'm just thinking it's a white space, but it's the white space between the panels of a comic book. That is insane that they would even think of something like that. Then with the, the most craziest shit I think I've ever seen. I see this and this show has man eating asses, all right? Uh, listen, literal asses eating people. But that, well, I don't even think that's the craziest shit. You had a moment where Flex flexes and everybody in the time comes. Everybody has an orgasm at the exact same time. And it's, and it's not like it's just, it seemed like it was an ongoing thing. It's like it was like it wasn't just one. It's like they were coming back to back repetitive. Like I would be like, "Hey, let me take a nap, okay? We we'll get we we'll get the chief in a minute. Let me take a nap because y'all, it is is crazy. I, I'm watching. I'm like, what is going on with everybody? And then Jay said, "Where well, I'm coming? I'm like, wow. They wow. That's uh, okay, okay. Then they all go to these places. They go to where all their lives started." You got Cliff, he's a steel smash. <laughs> this is a superhero show. Cliff in there gets some head and killing off the nanny. Like, who, who thinks of this? Like, he has a choice to stay there and not go kill it. And can't go kill his wife and, and daughter. <laughs> he said, this is the night you turn your car and your wife into a convertible. That was hilarious, but it was fucked up at the same time. Yeah, the moment when Jane, right before Jane got the shot, and she she got the all all the other the uh, the parts to herself. Yeah, the moment before Rita, you know what I'm saying, goes into the the water and she becomes like a elastic elastic woman. Um, you have the the moment when Cliff is at his uh, with his family before he goes out, and you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Say it becomes a char, a char Airbnb for the like, like it, the, the jokes are hilarious. Like you have all these moments where you're like, hey, you can stay in this moment and never have none of the bad shit that's about to happen. You know that's about to happen, happen. And that's gotta be tough for a lot of people. Even though you probably think like, hey, I've I've grown with these people. I go to care about these other people, but I can. This is like the shit that like. My life was bad, but like this is the moment that like fucked me up for good, and I cannot do that and just be here in this moment. I can save my people, my my family's lives, or 
You know what I'm saying? I can read this like, hey, I don't have to, I can continue to be an actress. There's so many different things these people could have done, but they say, no, that's not what we're going to do. And what I thought was ingenious was when they go out into the white space, Rita said, I'm tired of you telling my story. I'm about to narrate my own shit. And she starts narrating. And then uh, uh, the doctor, uh, the James pers uh, persona, uh, the doctor comes out. She starts exposing uh, Mr. Nobody because we've seen it at the beginning of this episode, Mr. Nobody. This is all because, like, the, the, the Brotherhood of Eva, they want him. And, like, his girl got tired of him. Like, she told him, like, you're going to be a nobody forever. And we see all of this. You think, like, hell yeah, they got his ass. They got his ass. He, and Clip, like, yo, dude, I, I just really don't want to fight. I kind of feel sorry for you now. And, like, you see Mr. Nobody losing it. And then Cyborg shoots his ass in the back. And you think, and then why you think, like, that could have been, like, a weak ending. It, but, like, I'm like, nah, I actually like that ending. It makes more sense. You know what I'm saying? I, I like this ending. <coughs> and then you see... Them going off the teams together, everybody going off doing their thing, and then they follow, going to the robot that Mr. Nobody had. And I was wondering, I'm like, how is that robot here? Like, is Mr. Nobody really gone? Or is this just like girl doing this? Or like did somebody did the, the, the Brotherhood of Evil take his robot idea and use it? And so then you see him be killed, and then you see it go back. And then you see this endless groundhog day type thing with like they're in the loop. I always I love loops. And then I, I, I keep saying and then, but 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 truthfully, and then you see Cyborg show up like, hey, what's going on, you guys? And then everybody like, who's this Cyborg? And we see it was Mister Nobody the entire time. They had never left the white space. I, I'm over here, like what the like what the hell had just happened? Somebody explain. I, I know what's going on, but I'm like, yo, I can't believe it. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Nobody's still here. They're still in the white space. Nothing they thought worked. Work. The, the cyborg that shot Mr. Nobody wasn't actually a cyborg. It was Mr. Nobody pretending to be cyborg so they could think they want. It's lunacy. And then all of it comes down to the chief telling them at the end of the episode, everything that happened to you guys, it was because of me. Does that mean Cyborg's mom died was because of him? Cliff's wife, him not being able to be connected with his daughter, Larry losing his family, like Jane, these personas that happened to Jane, Rita getting, like, he got some major explaining to do, and in a way that it's like, I don't know if you forgive him for that. Like, regardless of what he's done, it's like, can they forgive him for that? He's going to have to explain it in a way that's like, you're going to have to make sense of this, Chief. Like, you're going to have to give me some hate. The world would have ended. At it. And even at that point, I still don't know if I forgive you. You know what I'm saying? This show is spectacular. Spectacular. And I cannot wait to see how it wraps up because I have no idea what's going to happen because could Mr. Nobody be, be manipulating him again? Or is it real? Like you, you don't know. You just have to wait to the very end to find out. And I'm super excited about it. But you guys let me know what you thought about this episode down in the comments. Hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll catch up with you guys later. Peace.